how can we find the slope of a line when you don't see the graph of it from a table for example well it's not that hard guys let's take a look at this finding the slope from a table you need to keep in mind that the slope is calculated by finding delta y over delta x or in other words y2 minus y1 divided by x2 minus x1 either one works but i want you to notice something from the table look at the consistency here you always go three plus three plus three and here in y you always go minus six minus six minus six remember that this is also change change of y and change of x so can you see that in this case what is the change of y it's right here and right here is the change of x so we do negative six divided by three so negative six divided by three is negative two i'm done can you see how easy it is and let's do the same thing here how is x changing by adding two every time right what happens with y no change it's zero okay so let's see the change in y is zero the change in x is two zero divided by two is zero when you have a slope equals zero it means that you have a horizontal line okay in horizontal lines the slope is zero this line instead has a negative slope it means that this line goes like this guys okay now let's analyze this one the slope is remember change in y divided by change in x what is the change in x here zero right there's no change the change in y goes uh by three right so it seems like there was a problem here sorry it should have been this let's just correct this right away here so this, the change here is plus three plus three plus three so change in y is three and change in x is zero please please remember anything divided by zero is what we call an and of undetermined so if it cannot be defined it's undefined there's no way to know it means that this is a vertical line where m is undetermined or undefined that's it